king's your word. Well, you are Jesus of Nazareth, aren't you? Yes, I am. Well, that's what they're saying. You are the king, the Messiah. It's also said that you do miracles. Is this good magic or bad magic? Could we have some kind of uh, demonstration? I mean, can you do a trick for me now, say? No. I'm not a trained animal. I'm not a magician. Well, that's disappointing. This means that you're just another Jewish politician. Do you want to know something? You're more dangerous than the zealots. Do you know that? Say something. You had better say something. All right. Tell me what you tell people on the streets. Yes. Yes. The prophet Daniel had a vision. A tall statue had a gold head and silver shoulders. The stomach was bronze, the legs were iron, the feet were clay. A stone was thrown. The clay feet broke and the statue collapsed. Yes. You see, God threw the stone. The stone's me. In Rome. Rome is the statue, yes. So your kingdom, or your world, will replace Rome. Where is it? My kingdom? It's not here. Not on Earth. It wouldn't be, would it? You know, it's one thing to want to change the way that people live, but you want to change how they think, how they feel. All I'm saying is that change will happen with love, not with killing. Either way, it's dangerous. It's against Rome. It's against the way the world is. And killing or loving, it's all the same. It simply doesn't matter how you want to change things. We don't want them changed. You do understand what has to happen. We have a space for you up on Golgotha. Three thousand skulls there by now. Probably more. God! I do wish you people would go out and count them sometime. Maybe you'd learn a lesson. 